nothing. I'll see you girls later. Jesus. Aquí está su cafecito. Gracias. ¿Quieres azúcar? No. Mami, soy yo. Ay, Luis. Hey, hijo, ¿quieres un cafecito? Sí, un chin. Un chin. Uh, Luis, this is Mr. Santos. What's going on? Hey, I guess I didn't recognize you from your mom not having any pictures of you up on the walls. Yeah, I guess she doesn't have any up. Now you mentioned it. I guess mug shots don't sit along too well with graduation shots. Hey, who the fuck are you? Well, it's complicated. Mr. Santos is a businessman. It's not that complicated when you think about it. You see, your mother here has been making that classic American mistake. In other words, she's been living beyond her means. Hey, bro, be polite when you talk about my mother, man. I'm being very polite. See, I like her. She's a good woman. If I ain't like her, I would have burned this building down by now. I mean, you know you could have came to me for money. But what would you do to get it? Yeah, I wouldn't borrow it for a piece of shit like this. Hey, be careful, kid. I could have you killed. Oh, I'm real scared of you, motherfucker. Huh? How do you sleep at night, man? Long talking to all women. Hey, 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 she called me, okay? It's business. We run a service. She knew the rules. She should have read the small print. You know, you really are a piece of shit. I'm a businessman, and trust me, it could get a lot worse, my friend. Now calm the fuck down. Your mother told me about you. Maybe you can help me pay off your mother's debt. That way, this building doesn't have to come to an unfortunate end. Yeah, okay. Okay, let's go. As always, nice to see you, Miss Lopez. Luis, be careful. Yeah, it's a bit rich coming from you. You ought not to judge me, Luis Lopez. You're just like your father. Hey. Time for your fighter to shine, Santo. Get him changed and ringside. Remember our deal. Hey, I'm at time. Are you too fucking stupid to know when to lay down? Guess I must be. You're a fucking dead man. I'm gonna bring that bitch mom of yours too. Y'all don't think you are, tough guy. This little game's over for you. Yo, what the fuck is wrong with you, man? What you mean, homie? You can't be sitting here, man, watching him. Any fool policeman on the second day on the job will know you're the guy with the shit, man. You'll wind up back inside, you moron. It's nice to see you, Mr. Big Shot. Real nice to see you. Captain Downtown. Come up here to talk down to his old friends? Yeah, I just care about you guys, okay? I don't have a choice, man. My right-hand man got a single-digit IQ. Hey, H, come over here, man. Of course, I could do what you did. Run the fuck away. Go fuck a man or some shit? Yo, I ain't fucking no man, bro. Okay? I'm working the best clubs in the city. I ain't go nowhere. I'm ten minutes away on the train. Ten fucking minutes. What's up, H? It's like, it's another country down there. Ten fucking minutes. I give you ten fucking minutes. You ran away. Yo, whatever, man. Whatever. Whatever. You want a job, bro? I'll get you a job, man. You know that. Yeah, yeah, for sure, man. I want a job sucking some aging playboy's cock. I want that job real bad. Sign me the fuck up. <laughs> You're such a dick, bro. You would know. Enrique, would you get the moron to shut up, please? I'm sorry, man. I just miss you. But maybe I express myself coarsely, but we was like family. Oh, yeah, loco, we are family, man. But family doesn't mean we have to live up here slinging dope to a bunch of suburban punks from Aldene. Man, dando complain about how life could be. We on the doorstep, man. Liberty fucking city. We could run the fucking world, man. Oh, and you running the world? Or you running errands for some ass muncher? Yo, Tony's all right, man. 
He's, He's like, like the, the daddy, daddy I never, never had. had. Oh, <laughs> fucking sugar daddy. Hey, whatever, man. My mate. Eh, Luis. Boys. Hey, mama, hey, How Zero. are you, boys? Hey, <laughs> Hi, Luis. Oh, you look tired. Hey, mommy, I've been working, you know. I do know. That's the problem. When you're going back to school. Hey, mommy, por favor. I hear you going back to school, Armando. Doing an MBA, Mrs. L. <laughs> hey, let's go. Mommy, I gotta go. Okay, but here, take this. Grab it. <laughs> Luis, take your life more seriously, baby, please. Don't be like your father. Look at your brother, look at your sister. They're doing so well. Mommy, I know, but what do you expect? I gotta hang out with morons like these two, okay? Bye. <laughs> Let's go. Morons like us, eh, my brother? Ah, you know how mommy is. Oh, like a woman has been abandoned by her children? Okay. Lulu, 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 Lulu. I know you think we small, I know you think we ain't shit, but that's why I hit you up, man. Why? Because we got something real coming down. Yeah, the last time we had something real coming down, I did two years. Look. I'm not gonna insult your intelligence by telling you shit is gonna be different now. But it is. It is. Come on, trust me. Let's go. <sighs> Fucking cocksuckers. Papi, what's up, man? Hey, hey dímelo, mi hermano. What's uh, good? Chilling, bro. All right. Papi, what's up? What up, baby? Yo, but who's this clown right here? Yo, be easy, bro. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is Luis Lopez. He's our boy. Yo, you gotta say my name, bro. Luis, you don't gotta worry about shit. Papi's a businessman, legit. He's our connection, bro. Sure is package in town. You no, know, I got that raw, baby. You already know. <laughs> to a fruitful relationship. Uh, 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 Yo, what the fuck? That sounds. Yo, you motherfucker, you shut me up, huh? You a follow, right? Yo, we wasn't. Were you back? What's going on? What's going on? They must have got in our phones. Yo, fuck that, you fucking amateurs. I'm out of here, man. Yo, give me a second with this thing. Yo, that chopper's back. Get out of here. How the fuck we gonna get rid of this thing? Check the news panel. There might be something in there. Who the fuck the news will be packing one of these? Thanks, bro. You know I hate to ask this now, you all Johnny Lawful and shit. But me and Enrique are gonna need to do some serious work if we're gonna maintain shit on these streets. We could use someone we could trust. Mira, pana. You know I said I wouldn't get involved in that no more. I'll have to think about it, bro. Thanks, Luis. We'll see you soon, yeah? Hey, man. Hey, bro. Tony in? Yeah. Maury, Maury, sh no, no, Maury, Maury, no, I, I got the money, seriously, that's not the issue. No, I just want to make you happy. Is, is there anything else my team can do for you? No, we do events, parties. <laughs> no, anything you like. Just, just give it a think. All right, bye-bye. What a dick. What's up, T? Oh, I don't want to think about what's up. Come on, there's something I got to take care of. All right, think, think. Ah. You remember me? Of course, of course. Uh, my business partner, Mr. Lopez. Yusuf Amir. What is up, homie? Not much. <laughs> hey, you guys want to join us maybe for uh, a bit of this or a bit of that? Ah, uh, we'd love to, but we gotta go deal with some business. Okay, good. Good seeing you. Yeah. Take care, huh? Oh, 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 oh. And uh, if you ever want to talk about franchising this place, huh? Just give me a call. We will. We absolutely will. Hi. <laughs> Let's go, I'm in the mood, baby. Ya wallahi, ha, ha, wallahi, ha. Take this gun, Luis, just in case. Just in case? Oh, this is some sci-fi shit. I know a guy who gave me a deal. What can I say? It helps to be prepared. What are we doing in Chinatown? Take a guess. Another job for that Rocco. Oh, yeah? 
That moron pal of yours. After what happened at the driving range, we still owe that Brinkley fuck? I've done a lot of dumb things in my life, Luis, but none of them were dumber than borrowing from those pricks. Really dumb? Because you've done some real dumb things. I mean, you're still going out with Evan. This is serious. The fucking mafia. Even if we did have the money to pay them back, they wouldn't take it. They're gonna ride us into the ground. But you don't have the money, do you, Tom? Hey, what about that thing in London? That gonna pull us through this? Didn't I tell you? Shit, London ain't happening. And I wouldn't travel to that side of the pond anytime soon if you were thinking about it. Fuck, bro. Thanks for keeping me in the loop. Again. In that case, I guess my brother is in good hands. You take care of that prick. It seems the definition of family loyalty differs in your country. The marketplace has a value for everything, and I guess that a disloyal Jew bastard ain't worth shit to me, brother or no brother. Such are the heady joys of consumer capitalism. A system that's flaws are becoming increasingly evident. Ah, <laughs> that's right, I forgot. You little yellow people are commies too, huh? Both sides of the fence? You know, I grew up watching your kind getting killed on the TV. Hell of a show. I'm sure, but perhaps the show wasn't as much fun as the reality of that war. Hmm, perhaps not. Now I bid you farewell, sir, and don't do all that smack at once. On second thought, you know, go ahead. Do. Boo. Hey, watch it, you greaseball fuck. I apologize for our associate's uncouth manner. I can only say that our partnership with him is one of necessity, not volition. Please, you must be the famous Tony Prince. Ah, uh, notorious, maybe. This is Luis Lopez, my business partner. Hey. Mr. Pelosi has led me to expect much from this meeting. Ah, yeah, about that. Rocco has a tendency to promise more than he can deliver. So that must have been weaned too early. Yeah, we're not weaned at all. As you can see, we are already behind schedule on this project. We need you to, uh, how do I put this, to uh, clear things with the planning department and to ease some licensing troubles. Hey, look, we're not lawyers, okay? We run nightclubs, pretty badly, too. <laughs> we got enough trouble keeping the licenses on our own clubs, okay? We don't do licenses. Before I was being polite, Mr. Lopez, but I do not have to be. Mr. Pelosi made it clear that you are not in a position to choose who you help and who you do not. Yeah, well, that kid's got a big mouth, okay? And he ain't in no position to be writing checks for us, okay? We are not going to be able to help you. Period. Let's go, Tom. Sorry to waste your time, Mr. Um, you are not going anywhere until we have an arrangement. No, I'm afraid we are. There is no arrangement. You got a problem? Take it up with your boy Rocco. <laughs> you are not negotiating column inches and bar tabs, you insolent fuck! We are serious people! <laughs> really? Hmm. Yeah, really! <clears throat> Dude, what is wrong with you? I was supposed to be the irrational idiot with the anger issues. I got anger issues, okay? The guy threatens to shoot me because I can't arrange a liquor license for him. Please, give me a break, T. Oh, God. Oh, shoot. They're coming for us! They're Secure coming now! Why couldn't we play along? Oh, we out! You can't stop me! But my ancestors! Move up to me! I never thought we'd get out of that place! That was worse than spit class! My fucking heart! Hey, you need to look after yourself! I'm soaked through! I must have lost three pounds in sweat! Yeah, don't go looking for a bright side. Michael's big mouth nearly got us killed. Fuck! When I get a hold of him? You won't do anything, Lou. You'll play it nice. We can use this if we're smart. We were dumb enough to walk into the death trap for the kid. I doubt we're gonna pull brains out of our asses now. Leave it to me. You just concentrate on looking pretty. Yeah, absolutely, T. You've done such a great job so far. You gonna call Rocco then? Rip him a new one? I got a feeling we ain't the only ones who'll be ripping him, Lou. God, I need my pills. Don't take that shit, T. I'm serious. Hello. Homie! What's happening, man? Who's this? That's Yusuf Amir, man! Who? The guy who wants to talk about franchising your clubs! Hey, those conversations are usually Tony's department. Well, Mr. Tony gave me your number. There are some other matters I need to discuss before we get down to the real shit. Hey, if Tony gave you my number, then it's okay, bro. Great! Come hang out at my apartment. It's right on the middle park. Prime location. 